A very simple question. A problem solver using FiWi tool to identify the reasons for why the sales conversion in his organization are low found out that after three whys he has reached the bottom of the problem. So how should he proceed? Option one, continue to ask two more whys because it's a five-way technique. We need to ask two more whys without which the analysis is incomplete. Complete the analysis as he has reached the root cause. C, start from beginning as the current approach has led only to three root causes. So you again go back and start from the beginning. And D, as the cause has not reached 5y, it is not the root cause. So exclude this and proceed to the next cause. The point you need to remember to answer this question is this 5y, the 5 is the rule of thumb. So what we are trying to say is the real reason for any problem, the root cause for any problem is hidden by five layers of symptoms and this 5 is just a rule of thumb. It's not a law that you need to always stick to. So in this scenario, the ideal answer would be B, which is to complete the analysis because if he thinks he has reached the root cause, that should be fine. But in practical situations, while we still can assume this to be the root cause, I would personally also encourage participants from a practical standpoint, not from an exam standpoint, to go and take another cause, the next cause, and then drill down for that cause also because a real root cause is one which can lead to multiple symptoms like we have a pandemic now and we all have certain uh, symptoms multiple symptoms are shown but the cause is still the same right so all the items which you consider as a cause is not a root cause and ultimately they are all symptoms and so when you do 5y on each of them or most of them it should lead to something similar or something common which in itself will be the root cause of the problem so that could be one way to practically validate this